few years ago I used PayPal to send uh, some dollars to uh, a service uh, after that I received this mail uh, information important information confirm your information dear customer recently there been activity in your account that seems unusual compared to your normal activities uh, please visit the following website to complete the renewal of your information simply click on the web address below uh, and there is paypal logo so uh, it looks uh, genuine okay uh, just click view details here you can see that support 223 something at support intel, intel intl dot com this email is not from paypal uh, when you click uh, confirm let me open it in firefox it is going to another domain chindustry.ru php fc update account or something okay then you got a fake page fake paper page here you can type uh, email id this is a fake email id and see how they are handling this some random password click login would you like firefox to remember this login never okay now they are asking verify your account <laughs> including name address city postal code account holder name credit card number and see verification Okay, there is some kind of credit card validation going on. I don't know what it is. Okay, done. Okay, now you need to confirm your identity. You need to upload your uh, photo. Okay, this is perfectly. Uh, they're trying to uh, steal your identity, your credit card number, your uh, address, name, information, etc. To misuse uh, it. Uh, so always check the domain name okay congratulations you are going to read and they are redirecting to actual uh, paypal uh, website uh, here you can see a green sign uh, paypal.com secure and verified uh, by a semantic corporation so always check for https and the domain name paypal.com or any other site you are going to log in uh, it should be the original site name maybe there is some uh, small spelling changes like p p a y p e l dot com or uh, something like that you will be uh, cheated like that so even there is https always look for the domain name uh, paypal dot com or the sub the, sometimes uh, they will use subdomain like www dot paypal dot uh, some other domain some other name dot com so uh, always check uh, the domain name is 
from the original provider you are going to use uh, for example uh, bank or gmail or facebook etc always, always check the address bar the address bar is very important okay uh, if if i uh, give all the information like the original name credit card number etc uh, i will get uh, scammed uh, they will use that information to steal my money also they will use for uh, illegal activities so when you receive a mail like this you should check the address bar and also check the sender uh, email like this uh, this is not from paper uh, the, you can see that email id is fake even uh, the sender email id is paper the uh, the more important thing is the address bar because anyone can fake uh, that email id uh, that means uh, using a php script you can uh, send uh, a mail from paper.com or gmail.com so this can be from uh, shown like uh, from paper.com but actually the sender will be different so you cannot trust the from address from your mail so the only source is uh, the address bar never enter the personal details uh, on other domain or subdomain okay always make sure you are using an http site that is verified by a good company like semantic or uh, any other uh, popular companies and uh, make sure the domain is correct uh, if you are going to use facebook it should be facebook.com if you are going to use gmail it should be mail.gmail.com uh, or mail.google.com I, I forget that okay anyway uh, the domain name should be the original one now what uh, end it on never enter your personal details such as password or share credit card details on some random domain just because you see the icon or <laughs> the logo of that original site anyway that's it for now thanks for watching have a good day this is Vishnu bye